So, Newspapers and Education has been around since 1960. We partner with Oklahomans to provide teachers and students with educational resources through the Oklahoma newspaper. Our program reaches nearly 30% of the total statewide student population by servicing over 191,000 Oklahoma students. We have a presence in all 77 counties and are in over 600 Oklahoma schools. One thing I like to do in my classroom is teach across curriculums. In other words, in different subjects, incorporate different subjects. So whether you're teaching history, science, mathematics, language arts, or foreign language, you can use this uh, program to integrate those subjects. And the kids just love it because they don't know much about the newspaper. All of our small towns have newspapers, but they don't pick them up and read them. And so they're enlightened. They have no idea vital statistics are in them or they have no idea the comics are in them and it's a storyline that keeps continuing. I tell them it's like a soap opera. Um, they really enjoy the obituaries <laughs> and the marriages and the divorces and things. These kids have no idea that these are public records. And so you're teaching them about life. And the way I feel about the newspaper, it's something that they can use the rest of their lives. NIE provides three informational services to teachers and students throughout the state. And we're able to provide these services free of charge thanks to our incredibly generous community of donors. Those services include access to the digital archive of the newspaper with issues of the Oklahoman dating back to 1901, access to the digital print replica of the daily newspaper, and comprehensive curriculum inclusive of lesson plans and student supplements. Through newspapers and education, it, they really get engaged with the material that we're talking about. It's not necessarily a textbook and there's always fun and exciting activities that they get to use and through History Day they learn about how to use newspapers and the value of newspapers and so we really like partnering with uh, newspapers and education so that they can see value and use those in uh, the future. And as a newer business owner I'm still a little conscientious about where I go and what I do and knowing that you know this program is with the Oklahoman who's very reputable you know that we have a high regard for the Oklahoman that just makes it more valuable to us that it's a safe place to put in our time our energy and our resources into. Our curriculum covers a wide variety of subject matters that promote career development, STEM learning, health, economics, financial management, natural resource stewardship, Oklahoma history, culture, art, and social awareness. Uh, we really think that it's a great partnership and uh, like we need more partnership like that because this program in education is giving uh, a huge uh, tool for every other organization to have access to education, uh, education systems, students specifically, and also teachers, which uh, we sometimes forget about them because uh, we just think about the student and the the children but also they are the educators of those people so it's uh, we think that it's really a good mission that you already uh, are doing well. Well it's a broad audience to reach and uh, we've struggled uh, to communicate uh, to such a large audience and so we uh, we've only been able to focus on key elements or key parts of say Oklahoma City proper uh, but what NIE did was give us a, a broad range we could communicate across the state uh, through the, that, the great program so we put together some tools and some education pieces uh, that let us broaden our reach otherwise we wouldn't have ever been able to, to have that broad of a reach. We really think the Spelling Bee is fun to sponsor. It's fun to see students from across the state repeat year after year and grow year after year and just have a good time, put a little competition into the English classroom, which is a little bit different. You don't see that every day, and spelling is just fun. It honestly means a lot because there's nothing else like it. Just meeting people that like spelling, like the things like you do, it's really cool it's just I can't it's so awesome and I thank them a lot for doing that and just giving me the opportunity to go there and see all those new things what's even more incredible is when you take a closer look at the schools where our services are being utilized 
In January of 2016, we performed an analysis of our registered schools based on a report that was published by the Oklahoma State Department of Education. And what we learned through that process is that 36% of the schools being served by our newspapers and education program are schools in which 50% or more of the student body participated in the free lunch program during the 2014-2015 school year. This is significant. We're talking about populations of people that would not have access to resources like this if not for programs like ours. And I, I can remember this as young as second and third grade living in these poor districts that I, I didn't have access to that information. We didn't have even the internet in our classrooms to be able to look up anything. So as a kiddo, it was very a big deal for me and I love to read and I kind of love the way the newspaper smells <laughs> that I, I thought it'd be really awesome to be able to help other people who were kind of like me as a kid who didn't have access to that, to that information or didn't have access to that literature in their classroom. And that's what I was hoping that this, would, this program would give children the ability that I didn't have as a kid growing up. The resources being offered by NIE are resources that otherwise could not be afforded by schools, teachers, or parents. And these particular resources promote a more knowledgeable, responsible, and capable Oklahoma citizenship. Through the resources we are offering, Newspapers and Education has committed to promoting civic engagement and civic literacy in Oklahoma classrooms. Uh, we feel like we're supporting the community, supporting kids, young people, education. Um, uh, that's enough. You know, just to see what has been done every year. You know, I, I get copies of, of uh, all the, the materials that they send out and develop. And the people involved with this have been so great to us. I mean, even, you know, we don't think it's a big deal what we do, but we've recently received accolades and that kind of thing probably we don't deserve. But uh, so we're a part of a good thing and glad to be able to do it. Well... I think having our name out there means a lot to me. I'm very proud of our company and as long as it's been here and for us to sponsor something like this, um, it's good for topographic, but it shows that we are, we care and we're involved uh, with uh, the education process and uh, I think that's really what really makes me feel proud of being, uh, even though it's just money that we give, uh, it makes me feel very proud of our company in doing that. According to the U.S. Department of Education, raising a reader is the single most important thing parents can do to make sure that their children are successful. In fact, according to the Institute of Education, Research shows that kids who read the newspaper score 25% higher on achievement tests. And that is why we do what we do. Oklahoma's future begins in the classroom, and the newspaper is a vital link for developing students. So from the bottom of our hearts, we want to thank all of you for helping us to keep this program alive. <laughs>